Welcome to Horse Sense, where science meets the heart of the horse. Here, we dive into the hidden world of equine behavior, uncovering what horses really think, feel, and share with us. Long before satellites, whether apps or storm trackers, humans relied on animals to sense the changes in nature. Farmers noticed that swallows flew low before the rain, that cows lay down in fields before a storm, and that horses, restless, alert, sometimes even fearful, seemed to know what was coming hours before the skies turned dark. Even today, when technology surrounds us, horse owners still marvel at how their animals can sense a storm approaching before the first raindrop falls. Is it instinct? Is it sensitivity? Or is there science that explains how horses tune into the environment in ways we cannot? In this episode, we will explore the fascinating world of equine perception. We'll look at instincts shaped by millions of years of survival, the vibrations and sounds that horses pick up long before we do, and the subtle environmental cues that make them living barometers. By the end, you'll understand not just how horses predict storms, but also what their reactions reveal about the extraordinary way they experience the world. To understand why horses are so sensitive to approaching storms, we need to remember where they came from. Horses evolved as prey animals, living on open grasslands where survival depended on awareness. Every sound, every vibration, every change in the wind could mean the difference between life and death. In those environments, storms were not just inconvenient, they were dangerous. Flash floods, lightning strikes, and sudden winds could scatter a herd, separate foals from mothers, and expose them to predators. Over millions of years, natural selection rewarded the horses that could detect environmental shifts early. Those who sensed the storm and moved to shelter survived. Those who did not were more vulnerable. This survival instinct still lives in our domesticated horses. Even in a comfortable barn, their bodies and minds remain tuned to the natural world. They do not have the luxury of ignoring subtle signs, their biology tells them. Changes in the environment must be noticed or danger may follow. One of the most important tools horses use to detect approaching storms is hearing. The equine ear is an extraordinary instrument. Horses can hear both lower frequencies and higher frequencies than humans. This means they detect sounds outside our range of awareness. As storms develop, distant thunder rumbles long before we notice. Low frequency sounds travel great distances and horses are able to pick them up much earlier. While you might only hear thunder once the storm is close, your horse may have been listening to it for hours. But it's not just thunder. The wind itself changes tone as weather systems shift. Horses hear the way trees rustle differently, the way pressure changes alter the resonance of their surroundings. Their ears swivel independently, catching sounds from multiple directions at once. When you see your horse flicking its ears rapidly before a storm, it may be mapping the environment through sound in ways you cannot imagine. Horses also detect vibrations through the ground. Their hooves, legs, and even the sensitive structures in their joints can pick up subtle tremors. Long before thunder shakes windows, the vibrations of distant lightning strikes travel through the earth. Horses feel these changes as part of their survival toolkit. Researchers have noted that many large animals, from elephants to cattle, respond to seismic vibrations that precede storms, earthquakes, or heavy weather. Horses are no different. They may paw, pace, or lift their heads suddenly in response to vibrations that humans are completely unaware of. This explains why horses often appear unsettled or restless hours before a storm. They are not reacting to anything you can see. They are responding to an invisible vibration that tells them change is on the way. One of the most consistent signals of an approaching storm is the drop in barometric pressure. Humans can sometimes feel this shift in subtle ways, headaches, joint pain, or a vague sense of heaviness in the air. But horses with their highly tuned bodies are even more sensitive. 
The equine sinuses, lungs, and inner ear respond quickly to pressure changes. Some horses show signs of discomfort or agitation as the pressure drops. Others simply become restless, moving around more or calling to herd mates. Pressure changes also affect the way scents travel. Lower pressure brings a stronger sense of smell in the air. Horses with their powerful olfactory systems may suddenly smell moisture, ozone, or the electric scent that precedes a storm. To them, the air itself is announcing what is coming. Another fascinating layer is the role of static electricity. Before a storm, the air becomes charged with ions. You may notice your hair standing on end or feel sparks when touching metal. Horses, with their large bodies and sensitive skin, are especially reactive to these electrical changes. Some researchers believe horses can sense shifts in electromagnetic fields long before lightning appears. Their nervous systems, finely tuned to detect subtle changes, may respond to this invisible signal. This could explain why some horses panic suddenly, even in clear weather when a storm is still far away but the atmosphere is already charged. Owners often report their horses becoming spooky, neighing, or even bolting without visible cause, only for a thunderstorm to arrive hours later. To the horse, the storm had already announced itself. Horses see the world differently than we do. Their wide-set eyes give them nearly 350 degrees of vision, and their ability to detect motion is far sharper than ours. Before a storm, the sky changes not just in color but in the quality of light. Clouds thicken, shadows deepen, and the spectrum of light shifts. Horses notice these subtle changes long before we register them. To us, the sky looks only slightly dimmer. To a horse, the entire land motion on the horizon may become harder to track. Familiar objects look different under storm light. This visual distortion can make them wary, pricking their ears and lifting their heads in alertness. In open pastures, herds often stop grazing at the same moment, heads raised, scanning the horizon. They are not only looking for predators, they are noticing the way light itself warns of change. If you've ever stepped outside before rain and caught the earthy scent in the air, you've experienced just a fraction of what horses can. Their sense of smell is many times stronger than ours, and they use it constantly to evaluate their environment. Before storms, the atmosphere often carries ozone, a sharp, electric smell created by lightning high in the sky. Moisture also releases compounds from soil and plants, a phenomenon humans call petrichor. Horses detect these smells long before the first drops fall. Owners often report their horses raising their noses, flaring their nostrils, and sniffing the air in the hours leading up to a storm. They are not curious without reason. They are reading the invisible messages of the wind. A single horse may notice something subtle, but a herd multiplies awareness. If one horse detects a vibration, another catches a scent and another notices a shift in light, the reaction spreads instantly. This is herd survival. When you see an entire group of horses suddenly restless before a storm, you are watching collective intelligence in action. Each horse's sensitivity adds to the group's awareness and the entire herd responds. One flick of an ear, one sudden lift of a head can set the tone for all. This amplification explains why domesticated horses may become more agitated in groups before bad weather. They are not only reacting individually. They are mirroring each other, magnifying the signals until the entire herd is alert. Throughout history, horse owners have noticed this phenomenon. Farmers once relied on their horses to warn of coming weather. Cavalry soldiers reported horses becoming uneasy hours before storms, even when skies looked clear. Modern anecdotes continue the pattern. A trail rider may notice their normally calm horse refusing to move forward, only for lightning to appear on the horizon soon after. A stable manager may find every horse in the barn restless, pawing, and whinnying before rain begins to pound the roof. 
These stories are not superstitions, they reflect real, observable behavior rooted in biology. When dozens of owners across cultures and centuries report the same thing, we are looking at a universal truth about horses. Researchers studying animal behavior confirm that horses, like many species, alter their activity before storms. In controlled environments, horses have shown changes in heart rate, restlessness, and movement patterns hours before a weather shift. One study in equine behavior noted that horses spent more time moving around, less time resting, and displayed heightened alertness in the hours leading up to thunderstorms. These changes occurred even when no visible weather cues were present, supporting the idea that horses detect invisible signals like pressure, vibrations, and scent. While we may not yet fully understand every mechanism, the evidence is clear. Horses are natural barometers, tuned more finely than any instrument humans once carried in their pockets. With all our technology, humans have lost much of the instinctual awareness that animals still carry. Our senses are dulled by artificial light, constant noise, and a lifestyle disconnected from natural rhythms. Horses have never lost that connection. Their survival has always depended on reading the environment. Even domesticated horses in stables continue to track these cues. They live closer to the ground, closer to the wind, closer to the raw signals of nature. Where we rely on screens and apps, horses rely on instincts sharpened by evolution. This is why they know the storm is coming before we even look up from our devices. Horses remind us that the world is speaking constantly, in vibrations, in scents, in pressure, in the silent language of clouds and wind. Most of us have lost the ability to listen, but horses never stopped listening. Their survival has always depended on noticing the faintest shift, the smallest cue, when a horse paws the ground before rain or refuses to settle when the sky still looks clear, it is not superstition. It is awareness, they are tuned to frequencies of the earth that humans have forgotten. This is the gift of sensitivity. What we dismiss as restlessness or spookiness is often wisdom, the body of the horse knowing what our minds have overlooked. The way horses sense storms carries a lesson for us. In our world of forecasts and phone alerts, we rely on technology to tell us what is coming. Horses remind us that awareness is already built into the body if only we pay attention. Spend time with your horse before a storm and you may notice how they sniff the wind, how their ears twitch toward invisible thunder, how their muscles tense at vibrations you cannot feel. They are not just reacting to the weather. They are showing us how to reconnect with the natural signals we once trusted. If we listen, we learn. If we observe, we remember that we too are part of the same earth, under the same sky, breathing the same charged air before the rain. Understanding this sensitivity also gives us responsibility. Horses can become anxious in the face of approaching storms. As caretakers, we can help by offering shelter, reducing stress, and being the calm presence they need. Bring them into a safe space if lightning or hail is likely. Move calmly, avoid rushing, and speak with steadiness. Horses mirror our emotions. If you remain centered, they will draw strength from you. Just as they have always carried us through fields, battles, and journeys, it is our role to carry them through the storms they sense long before we do. Horses are more than companions. They are living barometers, seismographs, and mirrors of the earth itself. They remind us that storms are never silent, that change is never invisible, and that wisdom often arrives not through words but through presence. The next time you see your horse restless under a still sky, pause, breathe. Trust that they know, because long before the radar lights up, before the first drop falls, before thunder rolls across the hills, the horse has already felt the storm. This is the wonder of horses. They see what we cannot, hear what we miss, and sense what we overlook. They live closer to nature, and in their sensitivity lies a wisdom we would do well to honor. 
If you enjoyed this deep dive into the hidden world of horses, remember to like this video, subscribe to Horse Sense, and share it with fellow horse lovers. Together, we can uncover the science, spirit, and timeless lessons of the horse. Stay calm, stay curious, and always listen to the wisdom of the horse.